नमस्ते जय श्री राम होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर डूइंग गुड एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर दैट यू हैव होल्ड ऑन मी नाउ लेट्स सी हाउ दिस ऑगस्ट मंथ लुक्स लाइक बिफोर दैट लेट्स सी द प्लानिटरी चेंजेस सो गुरु एंड मार्स इज गोइंग टू स्टे इन हाउस एंड मर्कुरी सन वीनस आर गोइंग टू बी इन योर फिफ्थ हाउस बाय has ketu and uh, 11th house will have saturn retrograde and 12th house will have rahu okay so now let's see how the uh, first part is the health health uh, how is it going to be health seems to be fine you're going to be uh, accept a little bit of uh, eating spicy food and junk uh, and uh, something like uh, sweets you'll be craving more for this but apart from that it's going to be fine uh no, no major uh, afflictions as such and how is it going to be with respect to education education will be the highest focus for children as of now uh, and because the sun is going to transit there mercury venus lot of uh, things happening in your fifth house so for the higher education it's a great time and uh, how is the love relationship uh, going to be people who are single they will be highly focused on this right now they will be very much into uh, you know have to find a girl have to get married i want a girlfriend be or a boyfriend these thoughts will be running in your mind all right uh, coming to the all the major will be want excitement and that that uh, yeah, i want to start something new few might be starting a new business and few might be wanting to have child and uh, it's a Uh, kind of you know, intense thoughts will increase right now and it is also uh, the time for finding new uh, new relationships relationship doesn't only mean your you know uh, romantic relationships there are the kind of friendships also you'll be finding and coming to the marriage part how is the marriage part going to be marriage part is also going to be pretty fine because uh, the lord is in uh, the lord is uh, venus and he is going to be placed in the 11th though it is not as very very favorable house he is going to be in the, with sun and uh, in a unfavorable house till it's somehow manageable because buddha is also there so uh, but uh, and you do have to manage a little okay and now coming to the next uh, part that is how is the uh, job and profession job and profession is going to be uh, neutral and especially this month is uh, you might get a uh, recognition uh, and a few might also not want to work anymore because of the aspects of saturn and uh, uh, sun so there might be a little kind of mixed feeling happening there okay so this is all about the job for mesha people and mesha people overall this year is a year where you want to make more money and uh, want to do something like you know uh, with the savings so it's going to be uh, nice and this month is all about starting some new ventures for you and uh, and it is also like you know you might get a little more strict with your children or you might want to you know ground them or you know you punish them something don't be so just take it a little slow and just be a little more you know friendly with them sit down and talk to them all right um yeah that's uh, that's for mesha all the best mesha take care jai shri ram namaste vrishbha rashi you all are doing good so let's see how this august month is and uh, do comment and uh, let me know how you are feeling my um uh, predictions are okay what is happening in your life do let me know okay fine uh taurus august month 2024 let's see so right now you have uh, your own graha in your uh, your own guru in your first house so what happens is uh, people who are senior you know senior citizens definitely need to take care uh the middle aged ones uh, uh if they are indulged in you know secretive uh, uh secretive activities you have to be careful it's not the uh, it's not a good time to indulge in some secretive activities it's not fair it gets exposed okay and uh, uh you know generically uh, they are uh, people who will be drawn to spirituality right now okay 
you will be wanting to go to temples and you will be wanting to visit uh, you know some kind of dharmic places and uh, you might also just pick up some uh, book some astrology book or some uh, dharmic book and you might want to read it that is what uh, planets make you do and uh, also you will become a little more aggressive in your thoughts your thoughts and your speech also like you know you might sound a little harsh to people or you might be a disassociated or want to be in alone and this particular month you will also want to you also feel like just staying at home and working you know you want to have the luxury of work from home you want to just uh, want to sit at home and be alone and work from home that you will have the highest desire and um, you will also be uh, con recontemplating on the food intake that you are doing you know if you will be uh, thinking uh, of changing the diet patterns uh, so a lot of things uh, with, with related to that will be going on with all this you will have some amount of peace also in your uh, heart you know there will be some amount of a mild peace and calmness uh, in your mind that will be uh, going on that's a good thing right and if you are in relationship it's going to be a difficult thing because there will be a lot of uh, misunderstandings and you know uh, if you have uh, ex uh, they might be like you know coming back and going you know like um, that uh, or some kind of communication with your ex any of these things can happen if you are running in the same uh, you know the dasha antar dashas are going on then it might uh, be more likely to happen and uh, also you will be thinking a lot about like you know uh, i have to make my house look beautiful you you might buy new cushions and set up the house or change the curtains or a uh, few jatakam uh, where the higher rate of uh, you know higher uh, yogas they might buy the house or uh, purchase a vehicle also okay so all this also is seen and uh, with respect to health they have you have to take care of your health and uh, there are chances of gaining weight so you definitely need to take care and uh, might have digestive issues so definitely have to take care of food intake again okay just be cautious as to what you're eating how you're eating and the, the, the timings that you're consuming food you definitely need to take care about that all right fine and uh, uh, they, and with re, with respect to children uh, children you know people who are trying for children yes uh, conception it's a okay time you know it's a good time and also uh, you might get some joy from children people who already have children might get some joy and um, you know and uh, it's like uh, they might do something well in their school and you might find you might feel happy about it these small small joys what you get you know right and uh, how is the marital life marital life is going to be uh, also okay with challenges okay and your spouse might have small you know health issues not by petty uh, petty ones not major ones so they might have small health issues and uh, uh, you people might also plan for travels and you have uh, you will uh, with uh, with a lot of turmoil you will also have good understanding okay and uh, now coming to uh, uh, job profession uh, job uh, for many uh, vrishab rashi people it is going to be a challenge uh this particular month and uh, not a great time to take any great decisions or some serious decisions right now because uh, just wait for uh, next month or two you might be able to get some clarity at the same time a uh, few might get uh, recognized you will find a uh, recognition and uh, you will get some fame during this time in the present existing job okay so this is all for Vrishabh Rashi this particular month that is August. Namaste uh, Mithuna Rashi friends. Welcome to Anapurna Astro. Hope you all are doing good. And thank you so much for all the Guru Purnima wishes that you sent. Uh, thank you. I'm overwhelmed. Now let's see how this August month uh, looks like for all of you. Okay. August month is going to be a nice interesting month for you because with respect to work 
and with respect to courage it's going to be um, you know it's very strong so what is it like so if you are lacking that kind of uh, uh, bravery or if you are fearing something this is the time that you will be taking a strong step or a strong decision with respect to anything that you're waiting for so how is uh, the health the health is going to improve but you will have sleep issues you know there is some kind of uh, sleep disturbances you will not be able to have the deep sound sleep okay uh, that is going to be there uh, and also you will be uh, middle of the month you will again start thinking about you know the old things and uh, trying to see what really went wrong these things will be coming into your mind okay and also with respect to uh, education how is it going to be with respect to education you will put more efforts and also somewhere you know the online activities will be disturbing you it could be because of you know excessive use of mobile and just scrolling uh, blindly through reels or shots that will be a little bit of because third because third house and fifth house connection makes us be, uh, get uh, get to waste lost more time on internet so that's what is going to happen so just take a little care over there that will help you because it's the lord of 12th 5th and uh, 3rd are getting connected so here you need to pay a little attention and try to get into more focus and how is the uh, love relationships love relationships uh, you will get that extreme uh, courage and you just want to get adventurous and uh, people who are shy or scared to propose this is the time that you will suddenly see the surge in the uh, courage and you will just want to go and propose that person okay and uh, yes now coming to the marital life so marital life you need to definitely be careful because the lord is in the 12th house guru placed in the 12th will give some kind of uh, you know either if you are a senior citizen uh, you your spouse will have uh, health issues if you are uh, you know the middle aged couple where you will be finding some kind of you know misunderstanding with respect to bedroom life there is some kind of discord so you have to sit sort it out and uh, resolve the issue okay this will help to and and also you traveling you know to, traveling also will help go for a long distance travels or if you are uh, uh, you, you can also go for foreign travels this will improve uh, your relationships in fact going to uh, dharmic places and doing some dhanam also is a remedy all these things what i'm saying is also a remedy for the marital uh, complications what uh, one is going on one is going through okay either your spouse will not be well or you will have uh, you know some kind of marital discomfort or uh, you know some kind of disturbances so this is uh, with respect to marital life and uh, next is uh, profession so profession also uh, here if you are into some kind of research oriented uh, work you'll be doing great and if you are into some kind of uh, uh, secretive uh, uh, things like you know if you're into occult knowledge you're also going to be doing good but the rest of the people must not take any, uh, you know, high uh, risky uh, decisions. Just take a little care. And if you are into, if you are wanting to travel abroad, it's a great time. So yes, it's overall a good period. Take care of your health. Uh, go for walks. That will help you. Take care. Jai Shri Ram.